Hello, so in today's tutorial, I am going to show you how to download and use the Bitmoji app and Bitmoji extension. Okay, so I am going to show you how to download the Bitmoji app from your phone and then I'm going to show you how to download the Bitmoji extension on your computer. Um, you will have to have the Bitmoji app first before you are able to access the avatars on the extension that is located on your computer. So what we're going to do first is we're going to go to the app store and I am using an iPhone. So for, you know, everyone else that may have an Android, um, it would probably be the same steps, but it's probably not called the app store, maybe called PlayStation or, or play store or something like that. But when I get to the app store, I'm going to type in Bitmoji, wait for it to come up right here. You see Bitmoji, it says open because my app is already on my phone, but if not, it would say get, and then you would tap it and download it. And then from there, what you would have to do is log in. You're gonna log in with a with your Snapchat account because all the Snapchat account and your um, Bitmoji accounts all need to be the same so that everything syncs. And um, if you don't want a Snapchat account, then you can always log in with your um, email login but you still need to make sure that all your logins are the same so that everything will sync so when you get logged in the first thing it's going to do is ask you to create an avatar and the avatar is going to be a you know a man or a woman you pick whichever one you want once you do that it's going to make you um just go through the process of creating that avatar with the skin tone um you can pick any di different skin tone tone that you want um hair color hairstyle, hair treatment, all these things down here at the bottom, you will go through to pick or create your avatar. Once you are done with that, there's a, um, on the clothes hanger where you can pick outfits. If you pick any of these outfits, you cannot remove anything from the outfit or it will remove the whole thing. You can change the colors on it, but you cannot change individual pieces of the outfit. <clears throat> Once you are done with that and you've gone through all the other steps um if you see the little you see the little closet down there that stores all of your outfits that you've used or picked in the past so if you want to change for um a certain situation or a certain occasion you can always go back and pick that outfit it'll be available for you so that you don't have to go through those steps again and then once you get done with that you're going to click the um check mark save your avatar and everything is saved for you and then you can search different stickers um whatever you search like happy it'll come up um i know a lot of you are always looking for those um bitmojis with no words you would type in pose and all those different um bitmojis would um, come up and then like if I saw one that I wanted I could click on it my options come down at the bottom to where I can send it in a text message I can airdrop it I always use the airdrop function when I want to airdrop or send something to my macbook this is why I like um, to use apple products because everything syncs and it's a lot easier you can copy it and then paste it somewhere else um, you can save the image. You can do a lot of different things um, with that image. And then after you're done with that, and you've saved your avatar. You are now ready to use your Bitmoji extension on your phone, on your computer, which, um, like I said, anytime you want to change anything, you have to change it from the app, and then it, it um, syncs to your extension. So always do that first before you want to change an outfit or, or do something like that. Um, and so now I'm going to show you how to download your Bitmoji extension on your computer. So to download your Bitmoji extension, you're going to go to Google and you're going to search Bitmoji extension. And it's going to be the very first one that pops up. I'm using Google Chrome, so mine says Bitmoji Google Chrome. 
then here your Chrome Web Store is going to open up. And right here where mine says remove from Chrome, it's saying that because I've already added it. But in your case, you would click that and just add that um, extension to your um, computer. And then from there, your um, extension, the, the little extension is going to pop up right here beside your, your web browser. And so you'll just be able to easily click on it whenever you need to access a Bitmoji. So if I was going to open up a, um, a blank presentation, I would simply go right here to my Bitmoji extension, click on it. And I'm just going to use one that I've searched to say you want to look up po a certain pose. And it is taking a second to come up. There it is. And then I want this one. You can simply click and drag it and it will pop up in your um, Google Slides. Now remember, if you want to change your avatar, you want to change their clothes, that you have to use your Bitmoji app on your phone to do that, and then it will automatically sync to your extension. I hope this has helped you learn how to download your Bitmoji app to your phone and also download your Bitmoji extension to your computer.